Okay, a lot of times people start not want to know how do you schedule a movie and I recently taught a class uh, to MBA students at a university in scheduling and basically what it, you do is you take a script and you break it down. First you import it if you have it on a software such as Final Draft or a screenwriting software. You import it into the program that I use which is the industry standard and there are others but Movie Magic Scheduling. So you import the script into that and then you create a chronological of all the scenes from one through as many scenes that you have in your movie. Once you've done that, now you have to turn that chronological schedule into a shooting schedule. And so what you begin to do is you start to chunk uh, information. So you chunk everything that's going to be shot first at one location so that you can begin to organize how you're going to organize the shoot. So for example, Everything that's at a house, you'll chunk into one bit. Everything that's at a bar, you'll chunk into another bit. So once you do the first level of chunking and you have that, you're gonna make a decision, how many days are we gonna shoot for? And the days are determined by usually the budget and how much you can afford to shoot. So you may shoot for uh, 20 days, which is four or five day weeks, or 25 days, five five day weeks. If it's a non-union crew shoot, you might end up having it to be a uh, six day week shoot, um, which is a little tougher, but is doable. So once you make that decision as to how many days you're going to shoot, you start to chunk your schedule into days. Then you start going further and now you start getting into the fine tuning of it. Um, you organize it by actor availabilities and obviously your stars, you know, you want your stars to work uh, five days, ten days in a row. You don't want to break up their work day because it's going to cost you more if you spread their days out. So that's another level of chunk. So there's a lot of uh, micro chunking that you're going to have to do to get to an actual shooting schedule. You're going to break down exteriors from interiors. You're going to shoot the exteriors first and then move into interiors. You're going to make decisions. You're going to want to stay at a location until you wrap it before you move on to another location because otherwise it'll be counterproductive to you time-wise and budget-wise. So these are a lot of tips and you can find a lot of this information uh, online nowadays, YouTube videos. You can find uh, how to use Movie Magic Scheduling on YouTube videos as well. So if you buy the program, you can kind of learn and tutor yourself through that form of uh, education. So there's a lot of ways to do it, but the best way you're gonna learn over time is experience and asking people who've had more experience how do you schedule and particularly first ADs eventually take the schedule over from the producer, line producer, um, and then they kind of break it down into the final shooting schedule. So your first ADs are, are probably a very important key people on your team to be able to do this.